So let's introduce them both. In the blue corner, fighting out of the Assassin's Gym, it's Alex, the Executioner Punch! Well, representing the Paul Ripon Academy, it's Connor Saint George! For the IKF British Junior K1 title, and your two warriors in the ring, in the blue corner, representing the Assassin's Team, Alex, the Executioner! Whoa! And his opponent across the ring in the red corner, representing the Paul Whitman Academy, Connor So here we go, five two-minute rounds of action. What an atmosphere, both young men brought huge support with them here tonight. First the potential five, the touch gloves. And both men look to probe with low kicks, front push kick. From George as he pushes forward, Teep as Hook looks to come back at him. Hook looks to work the leg. Both boys look to work the knee in the clinch. And touch gloves and go once more. Hook skirting the ring apron as George looks to walk him down, puts the knee in. Hook looks for the big right hand over the top. The crowd getting behind both these young men. George with the right hand lands clean. The left lands clean from Hook in reply. I knew it'd be this sort of bout, and here they go. Superb opening round already. George again looking to work. Walk Hook down and they go into the clinch. Checks the low kick from Hook. Looks to come through with the hands over the top. Spins to the midsection of Hook as well. Ducks under the spinning back fist from Hook and he needed to. Landed clean with that jump kick. George. And they tie it once more. The first knee in that clinch from George. Forcing hook back, looks for the little right uppercut, left hook, left round kick, then the right uppercut, checks the kick, comes forward with the left and right, George, looks for the uppercut on the inside as well. Right uppercut, right round house from George, they tie up once more. End of a big first round and you've got to say in terms of aggression and technique landed, for me that's the red corner. Connor George, K1 rules, kept forging forward, kept looking for the openings. Hook good on the counter but George the man forging forward. And this time as Connor George comes in, sharp little right hand from Alex Hook. And they tie it once more. Both young men looking for the low kicks and get into the clinch again. Spin kick once more from George, just out of range. Looks to chop low at the legs once again of Hook, who replies. George closes the gap, looks for those little shovel up attached to body and head. Works well on the inside, George, in these opening two rounds. Hook the round kick to the midsection, looks for the right. George skips inside it. Both men tie up the game, break cleanly. Oh, the spinning back fist just misses again. That's twice now that Hook has looked to land it. If it lands clean, it's a knockout blow, but both times George has just seen it coming and made sure it missed, but it didn't with that right roundhouse. Stinging right roundhouse from Alec Hook there. 
Hook to the midsection, cheap kick from Connor George and the short knee. Looks for the right uppercut, left round as combination. Hook to the body. Bubbling nicely this one. Hook again with the right round kick. George looks to work on the turn. Knee to Alex Hook. Looks for the right and left. Turns again. Hook turns and once more looks for his own right hand. It's that sort of bout. Hook forging forward, left and right for the body. Connor George checks the kick, looks for the shovel right uppercut again. Right at the end, but for me, over the whole two minutes, I thought Alex Hook turned that around and brought that one back very close. Three or five fever pitch here at the casino rooms for Combat Zone Warriors. And Connor George looking to push Alex Hook back with knees, those hooking and uppercutting punches. Spinning back just again, a whisker away from landing from Alex Hook. That's three now, the warning signs are there. takes the short chopping low kick from Hook, Hook with a shot to the body, George responds with the knee, that one into the groin, went for the midsection but that was, that was a groin strike, Touch gloves. And George walking his man down again. Make it from George as he walks forward. Little right hand from Hook. Glances off the side of the helmet of George. Oh, the leg kick lands cleanly though. George responds. Gets caught with the left on the way in. Just misses with the spin kick. Kick to the lead thigh of George from Alex Hook. Connor George responds coming forward. Big body shot with the right hand from Alex Hook. Knee from Connor George as he comes forward. And replies with the head kick. That's one each now in this round. Low kick from Alex Hook. Responded with a left and right from Connor George. Well, for me, both men had their moments in that round. You had the head kick from Alex Hook, which caught the eye. And then Connor George responds with one of his own. Round four of five, and Connor George looking to walk Alex Hook down. Looks for the little knee, turns his man. Looks for the knee again as he comes in. Straight back to it. Jab to the midsection from Alex Hook. Connor George with the short knee. And again, spin kick by Hook lands on the chest of George. And then the round kick to the head. George responds. Knee from Connor George as they close the gap. And kick to the midsection. And again, the short knee from Connor George. Nice left of the body from Hook. 
Looks for the same again after the right hand. And left, right, right round hands from George. Then the knee again. Lands cleanly with the knee. Nice combination from George as he came forward there. And the knee once more. Then the right hand. Nice left to the body, right round kick from Hook. Again, Hook looking to work the right hand side of the body of Connor George. And George looking to use the knee again when they're getting close. Right at the bell, the left hand from Connor George. Again, another close round. Could say possibly the separating factor from the two is the knees that Connor George regularly pumped in. Hook looks to come forward with the round kick. Connor George with the knee. Spin kick just finds the target from Connor George. Hook with the spinning back fist. Knee again from George as they clinch up. George looks for the knee again then turns. Left and right through the channel. work to the body from Hook. George skips out of the way of the response then comes back with his own left and right. Spinning back fist just glances at the top of the head. George saw it coming, ducked the head down. Big knee again from Connor George. High point head kick from Hook. Another knee as they clinch from George. Low kick from George, responded by Hook. Hook again to the body, the knee from George, and the round kick to the head. George just inside as Hook went to throw the shot. What a bad, as I thought it would be, superb contest this. Very close indeed, two very good young men in that ring. And it'll be very interesting to see how the judges have gone on this. The